In this video, we will have a closer look on how to save user symbols. Let's start by creating a new drawing where we can do our work. Now let's go to the grid settings. And uh, here we will select 1 instead of 10. Now make sure to select the recommended settings, the symbol layer in this case. Then we can start drawing the geometry of our user symbol. Now let's save our symbol. Let's go to the menu and uh, add symbol in a suitable symbols menu. And now let's create a user plug socket. Select the object included in the symbol. Then we need to place out the EID. It's a mandatory attribute. Define the insertion point for the symbol. And let's give the symbol its own name that makes sense to us. Now let's define the wiring points. Let's define the symbol type and system layer. We can also add additional attributes. In this case, we add IP class. Let's add another attribute. in this case power properties and then select the menu where symbol is saved and add the tip text it is also possible to use an existing symbol as a template Then we pick Explode. Now we can make our change to the symbol. Create the user symbol of our new symbol. We should select the symbol insertion point. Give the symbol a name. Define the wiring point. and uh, give uh, the tip text and we're all done now let's check out how to save fluorescent luminaires with definition function let's press this button for it now we can define the properties Now we will define tip text and name in specifications. And there we have it.
Now our symbols can be found under user symbols. Let's check it out. So here is our switch. And uh, here we can find our plug. Now we should look at defining scale for scalable symbols. Here we can change it. Let's see how we can edit our user symbols by pressing File, Drawing Files, Open Symbol and clicking on the symbol to edit. After editing a user symbol, remember to purge this drawing with the purge command. Now let's check how to edit the symbols menu. Then we go to modify icon menu and then we select user menu, menu file. Now it is possible to remove the icons by dragging them to the recycle bin. Now let's edit the tip text. We can drag and drop to change the locations of icons in the icon menu. Don't forget to save. With our defined wiring points, you can also change the insertion point of the symbol by using the tab key. By pressing wiring, we will get to see the wiring points. It's the yellow dots. If you have questions, feel free to contact us.